This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at triglycerides. Triglycerides are produced in condensation reactions between a molecule of glycerol and three fatty acids. On the left, we have a molecule of glycerol, which is also called propane 123 triol. As you can see, it has three hydroxyl groups. On the right, we have a fatty acid, which is steric acid. It has a long hydrocarbon chain with a carboxyl group at one end. Next we look at the formation of a triglyceride. Triglycerides are formed from a molecule of glycerol and three fatty acids. The OH group on the fatty acid and the hydrogen atom on the glycerol molecule react together to form a molecule of water. This is known as a condensation or esterification reaction. Because there are three fatty acids bonding to the glycerol molecule, in the reaction, three molecules of water are produced. The bond between the glycerol molecule and the fatty acid is called an ester linkage. Next, we'll compare the melting points of triglycerides made from mono or polyunsaturated fatty acids and those made with saturated fatty acids. The triglyceride on the left is formed from monounsaturated fatty acids which have carbon to carbon double bonds. The triglyceride on the right is composed of saturated fatty acids which have carbon to carbon single bonds. Triglycerides which are composed of monounsaturated or polyunsaturated fatty acids have lower melting points and are known as oils. Triglycerides formed from saturated fatty acids have higher melting points and are known as fats. The lower melting point of a triglyceride made from monounsaturated fatty acids is due to the presence of carbon to carbon double bonds. The carbon to carbon double bonds produce a kink in the chain which prevents close packing of molecules. This results in weaker London dispersion forces between the triglyceride molecules and therefore a lower melting point. If the fatty acids have carbon to carbon single bonds, there's closer packing of molecules which results in stronger London dispersion forces between the triglyceride molecules and a higher melting point. Let's end with a summary. Triglycerides are composed of a glycerol backbone and three fatty acids. The reaction is a condensation or esterification reaction in which water is produced. Triglycerides made from saturated fatty acids have higher melting points and are known as fats. Triglycerides made from unsaturated fatty acids have lower melting points and are known as oils.